again. All right, this time I'm going to attempt to talk my way through the startup of a jet exec. Let's see how well the audio handles this during the startup, because obviously the frequencies of the background noise change considerably, but I have doors off at the moment, but we'll do this anyway. See how she goes. All right. So, I already did my walk around, check, did the EFIS, I uh, did my AWOS and set my altimeter. Safety belts are on, controls, check range of motion. All. Five Delta Whiskey reporting mid field, right hand wind, we're on runway 25. Five Delta Whiskey, runway 25. Return them to the op 25, Five Delta Whiskey. Throttle is off, and I'm going to turn the fuel pump on. And then a second later, turn on the governor and then hold the starter switch. I'm going to do that, holding the starter switch, uh, until I get about 50% of the um, engine RPM, and that will be stable and I can let go of it. If during that time I don't hear a light off, which should occur about 25 to 30% RPM, I'll abort the sky. I'll, uh, I'll shut off the fuel pump, shut off the governor, and uh, let it spin down. But when I do have the start, go all the way up to 50%, that means it maintains a stable idle, and I let go of the uh, starter. So we'll go ahead and do that procedure here, and I'll talk through it as I do it. All right. Fuel pump on. Clear. Governor on. Steer. Let's need that light off. I heard it right there. Accelerating up to 50%, and I can let go of the starter. We're in stable idle. Give it a little bit of, of RPM, so I don't want it derping too much. Get up to just a bit over 50% there. And start as I dial up and go above 52%. I want my collective at about flight height, because that's where it starts to engage the uh, Last American bearings. I go up to about 54%. I leave it about there, let the blades come up to speed until my rotor RPM starts to climb. Once it gets to about 30%, I start lowering the collective. Sometimes I give it a little bit of extra throttle here just to get it to about 58%. It seems to be about the good spot where the blades like to fully engage. Watch it down here. This one doesn't quite register right, uh, but as I'm watching down there, look for the needles to match. There they do, you can hear them match. So now I can bring up the throttle just a little bit more because the clutch has engaged. Gets to about the mid-60s, I keep it pretty gentle here until I know that the fans have really gone out there by about 70%, so they should be now. Turn my alternator, make sure I'm getting juice back to the battery. And I can uh, roll on throttle all the way to 100%. All right, engine is on, it's stable. I now make sure I make switch on the rest of my switches. Radiator and my uh, strobe lights. And um, start my GoPro. And my, uh, here, normally I start the GoPro. Uh, and start my watch to track my flight. Stow away my startup procedure. Because I don't have doors and everything, I store it underneath this seat here. And it holds that in place inside this pouch.